before we continue, we need to take a step back and introduce the navigation controller. Navigation controller is the most common way to navigate between screens. Up till now, we'd seen the set root screen navigation, where there is no back button for the user to go to the previous screen. With the navigation controller, every time we push a new screen in the navigation stack, iOS automatically creates a back button on the top left corner. To use a navigation controller, we need to enable it in the screen navigation of the first screen. In our project, we are going to enable navigation controller in our list post screen, so that we can push new screens in it. To do this, we need to change the screen navigation that displays the list post screen. Let's go to the screen navigations, select the set root list posts, and enable navigation controller. If we run the app now, we can see that a navigation bar is added automatically at the top of our screen.